All right, so round five, and I'm here with what? So what's your name? Uh, Micah. Wait, you want to come out of this one? Yeah. Micah. Micah. I'm here with Micah, round five, and I'm playing Chaos and Chaos Demon. So just take us through your army, man. So I've got a Soul Grinder with a Mark of Corn, just vanilla. I've got two units of Plague Bearers with Plasma Cannons, or Plasma Guns. A Bloodthirster with a Greater and Exalted Reward. A unit of ten Plague Bearers, which look like zombies. Three units of two obliterators with Mark of Nurgle. One unit of Plague Marines with two Melter Guns. A unit of five Screamers. A General with a Mark of Nurgle and a Burning Brand. Yes. Who's also got instant death because of the gift of mutation. That's right, and we've got this giant ass rock, so you'll see that in the time lapse. And my conga line, two Turbagons, two Hive Tyrants, and my reserves. All right. All right, game five. Um, damn. All right, tell, okay. me what, well, tell me what your plan was. <laughs> okay, so... What was your overall plan? You're playing Tyranids, your brother plays Tyranids a lot. I'm expecting a turn to big hit. What I... I'm definitely scared of the Doom. Mm -hmm. um, what I'm trying to do is get you away from my general, um, generally away from a whole lot of the stuff. So I'm just turtling at the moment. Mm -hmm. just want to set up a turtle. Yep. Hopefully get my Soul Grinder into combat with one of your monstrous creatures or just tie up the little devil gaunts mm -hmm. if they show up. And just then outshoot me I guess. Yeah. Alright so we'll get into it right now and uh, yeah you gave me first turn which is, I don't know, demons seem to love that. And because it was night fight. Yeah it is yeah. night fight. Um, so yeah I'm using that big ass, I didn't actually block too much for the camera but um, big ass rock there, line of sight which is always a good thing. Um, just slowly moving forward. It was pretty bad luck that you had only one Iron Arm and one Endurance. Yeah, my psychic powers this, this game was not good. Um, I would rather just kept the, the base powers and had two Feel No Pains rather than just the one. Yeah. Um, here comes your big boy, he's yeah. flying across the table. So I sent my Bloodthirster up there to try to put a little bit more pressure on mm -hmm. and to um, force you to choose between going for my Bloodthirster with a shooting or to go against the rest of my army. Mm -hmm. um, and now here's me, he's got, I got all my reserves and here we go, look deep strike and mishap oh. and they all die. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was a game changer right there, yeah. I don't think I could have survived. Yeah, because um, this was kill points, yeah. so you got first blood and two kill points and that's 240 points down the drain. Um, but my Dooms plays well and as you'll see in a second, he eats up, he makes about three times his points yeah. in only two turns which is fantastic. It's a big hole in my arm. Yeah, and the Yurgmol again. When I charged the the middle squad of Yurgmols, I've got fleet, and it would have I would have made it yeah. in, into combat with your Obliterator. Yeah. Um, but instead, I just get it into combat with your Soul Grinder. You just fed my Grinder. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Armor thirteen. I hate it. Yeah. <laughs> um, here's me trying to also drop your uh, land your um Bloodthirster. Bloodthirster doesn't happen. You didn't fail a single one. It no. was only you forgetting yeah. to fly that actually made me made him land. Yeah, that's it. Um, yeah, so my doom kills quite a few of you guys. Um, was it three yeah. obliterators and a couple of the, um, the plague bearers? Plague bearers. Um, I pop a rhino. I charge you guys in sight as well as the obliterators uh, at the top here. Yeah. Um, they didn't work as well as they probably should have. Yeah, they probably should have done a lot better than that, but you're just unlucky today, I guess. Never mind. So what were you thinking here? Okay, so I'm trying to slide my screamers up. Um, I know that the table quarters are going to give you points, so I'm trying to use the screamers eventually to um, slash attack your gaunts. Mm -hmm. Also, if I do manage to um, ground one of your um, hive tyrants, then I might do some slashing attacks against them, try to mm. force some saves. Yeah, and you just you vector strike my guy. Yeah, that was fantastic. Three wounds straight away. And what else? Oh, ah, yeah, just moving around your plague bearers and things like yeah. that. I'm getting my general away from the center. Yep, and there's the bloody um, grinder finishing off my gene stealers. Like, I, I, think I didn't cause anything. I caused no. one and yeah. you saved it. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Fantastic grinder. What a, um, what a guy for 30, 135 points. And I finally killed the, I think next turn actually, I finally killed my gene stealers, um, your plague marines. Yep. Hive tyrants popping some more rhinos, but I don't have any backup anymore because you killed my. Um, my doom with a melter gun. Yeah. And I failed that save. I was very lucky with that. 
Fantastic. Uh, well, that, that was it. You had nothing else really shooting. That's right. If I if I'd survived that, it would have been a difference because I would have had then two half tones and a doom floating yeah. about. But the only shot I had with that was a power fist if I charged in, which mm. I would have. But I was very lucky. Um, you've put your hive tyrants very close to my stuff, so you've kind of forced my hand here. Mm. Um, this was a really, you know, a good luck turn for me, for sure. I've grounded both of your hive tyrants. And then killed them in shooting. Yeah, or killed your, your general and knocked a couple of wounds off the other guy. Oh yeah, and then you charge him, that's yeah, right. with the salt grinder. Yeah, yeah. No, you did well. Um, I didn't make any of my, uh, or I made one of my grounding tests. Whereas you made, <laughs> with your blood test, I want six. Uh, no, more than six. So I shot him with three units three times. Yeah. It was, it was very lucky for me. This is a very lucky turn. I, I can't say anything else. Yeah. You had me at the start. Yep, that, it's all good, man. It's my first loss of the tournament and it couldn't have happened to a better player. <laughs> A better person. Well, it's, thanks. Uh, I, I think you, you you play pretty well against like my army. You know, you you, you learnt from what you um, it's not, got not, from your brother. Yeah. You know, you, you knew how to deal with it. You were a bit unlucky with Doom, but you, in the way you played and yeah. you deployed, it, like I wouldn't necessarily have done anything different. It's not a very imaginative game plan of mine. The the bottle. Mm. It's it's pretty boring, I'd have to say. But this is the last game of the tournament. My cognitive capacity was pretty low, and I. You know, first tournament, I just didn't know what to expect. I was kind of freaking out a bit, so I was just playing it safe. No, I like it. Oh, yeah, so my Bloodthirst, I forgot to fly him. He lands, obviously, the um, and I may as well charge the, the Gaunts, yeah. so that's what happened. And he there. cleans up, though, man. He killed, what, over 20? Yeah. So All I think by you himself. had 12 left. Yeah, and only caused three wounds, and you kept them forgetting your um, endurance thing. Yeah, uh, the, yeah. That he, he will not, not die. die. And, um... Yep, you're claiming, you're just wrapping up here, claiming table quarters. Big win to you. Oh, thanks.